everyone! Welcome back to Just Shiny Things! I know I've been inactive lately and I haven't uploaded new content much, but I have some good news! I just bought a new cosplay from Taobao last November 11 sale, and it was that time when I recently finished watching The Promised Neverland. And apparently, because I love the anime so much, I decided to cosplay Emma! So without further ado, we're going to check out the cosplay I bought last 11-11 sale. So this is what I bought. Emma's uniform. Orphanage uniform. Orphanage uniform. <laughs> Just kidding. It's not really an orphan mage. <laughs> so here it is. It's just a plain white uniform though. It's a plain white polo shirt, long sleeve polo shirt, and a plain white skirt. Um, it also has freebie tattoo numbers like the one you see on my neck. See? And... Um, I bet you guys are wondering why would Jeannie buy that set when she can just sew it or find it in the thrift store. The reason why I bought it is because it was on sale. I got it for a really cheap price and I was feeling lazy and I was busy so yeah, why not just buy it? So this is the tattoos. Apparently, there's only one tattoo here that's for Emma. The others are for Ray and Norman. But um, I'm not cosplaying Norman or Ray. Maybe I'll just give this to someone else. So, yeah. The center one is Emma's tattoos. And next one is the shirt. It is neatly folded. I like it. It's just a plain polo. I really like the quality of the fabric. I might actually even use this for other cosplays too. So, win-win! And next up is the skirt. It's just a plain pleated skirt. But I really love how clean the pleats look. The folds, all that. It's perfect for Emma. Next up is the wig. I actually bought this from Ruler Shop in Taobao. And the wig disappointingly came out to be flat. I had to style it myself. I'm sorry if I didn't post a tutorial though, but yeah, I had to style it myself for it to look like Emma's hair. All those spikes and stuff, you see? I wasn't going to buy new boots, but then it was on sale again, so I had to grab it. See? It's perfect for Emma! And it's size 37, perfect for me. I also got this from Taobao. I didn't have it shipped with the box because, you know, the box would make the shipping fee more expensive. So I got it just wrapped in these cotton thingies before I try out the costumes for the first time. I would like to let you guys know that Jellyfish Education is now accepting enrollees for December. If you guys want to learn, uh, Japanese, I would highly recommend Jellyfish Education because they're currently offering 1,000 pesos of your tuition fee if you enroll on or before December 12. Plus, you will also get a one-month free subscription. And if you guys want to learn more, feel free to visit my Facebook page. The link is in the description below. So without further ado, Let's try out the costume!
hope you guys like the costume on me. Thanks for watching this short cosplay review of my Emma cosplay. I hope you guys will tune in to my next cosplay review vlogs because I've got more incoming costumes. And if you're new to my channel, feel free to hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell so you can be updated with my future uploads. That would be all! Thanks everyone! Bye!